Hey, what's up, guys? Mini Car Tricks 99 here, and today I'm going to be performing and making a tutorial of one of my personal favorite car tricks. A lot of people like this car trick, and it's it's one of my personal favorites. So let's see the performance. So just pick any car in the deck, anyone you want. So you can pick this one right over here. And for car trick purpose, purposes, I don't want to see the card, so I'll just try to show the camera. Hopefully you saw that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the card, stick it somewhere around the center of the deck. Just like that. Give the card a little bit of a shuffle. When you're doing this trick, you don't want to see the spectator's card at all because it's it's all about not seeing their card. You don't want to see it. So let's just give it a few more cuts and one more shuffle. Okay, so the cards are all mixed up. I don't know where your card is, so what we are going to do now is we are going to play a little game. And the game is called Lie Detector. So what this game is about is I'm going to flip over a card and every time I flip over a card you're going to say that's it. Okay, even though it's not your card, you're going to say that's it, but hopefully I will flip your card. But every card I flip, I'm going to say that's it, okay, so let's begin. Is that your card? That's it. Okay. I'm going to place it down on the table. Is that your card? That's it. I'm going to place it down on the table. Is that your card? That's it. Okay. Okay. You know what? I don't believe you that any one of these three cards are your cards. You were lying to me all along because your card is actually right over here. This is your card. Oh, it's not? Okay, I'll prove it. I'll prove that it's your card. I'll put it right down over here. Now look. None of these cards are your card, right? Because just like I told you, this card right over here is your card. What's going on guys? This is the tutorial for the lie detector card trick. So let's begin. So what you want to do first is just have the spectator pick any card at all, any card of the deck, doesn't matter really. So it chooses this one. Nine of diamonds. So what you want to do from here is just get a big pinky break on the first card. And when you stick the card back in the middle, you're actually going to stick it second from the top. But really it looks like the middle from their point of view. So just stick it in there make sure you should have a pinky break under the top card just just stick it in under the top card give the cards a few shuffles but you ha have to keep their card on top of the deck and the first card okay that was a weird shuffle let me try again and you can also do a bunch of false cuts and whatever cuts you'd like just like that one more shuffle should do okay so the cards are all mixed up perfectly pretty good well and the two cards their card is still second from the top so what you want to do from this point is um get a pinky break on the bottom of the deck below two cards so what you would just you can just go right down and stop at two cards just like that you just want to riffle down and stop at two cards so see i got two cards so just riffle down with your pinky stop at two cards get a pinky break and what you want to do from that point on is transfer that pinky break into a thumb break and swing cut half the deck over in your other hand just like that and from here here you're in this position you obviously have your break here with your two cards 
So from here, their card is second from the top card. So now you explain them the lie detector rules and game, but you don't want to flash these two cards. It shouldn't be a problem. So you just tell them that you're going to turn over a few cards and if it's their card and if it isn't their card, they should say it is. Yes, that's my card, no matter if it is or if it isn't. So let's do it. Is that your card? Yes, that's my card. Okay, then just place that card down on the table and the next card is going to be their card. So from here, you're just going to turn the card over, ask them, is that your card? They're going to say, yes, that's my card. And then right when you, when you, when you flip it over again, you just want to drop these two cards on top of the nine without them seeing. So it looks something like this. Is that your card? Yes, that's my card. Just drop and drop the two nines. So what I did there is I just dropped the two extra cards on top of the nine. Just like that, just place it down on the table so they think that's their nine. But really it isn't, it's just a random different card. So then just turn one over again. Is that your card? Yes, that's my card. Turn it over, place it down on the table. So once you have three cards down on the table, this card is going to be their card, the next one on top of the deck. So from here you're just going to say, you know what, I don't believe that any one of these cards are your cards. Place this packet with the nine on top, place it on the other packet in your hand. So the nine is now on top of the deck. And just tell them, I don't believe that any one of these three cards are your cards. Get a double lift right over here. Just do a riffle. Get a double lift under two cards. And tell them that the top card is actually their card. This card right here, it's your card. But really, you know, it's not their card because their card is concealed right under the nine of clubs. So you just want to do a double lift, pinky break, and just do your double lift. Say, that's your card. And I'm going to prove it. So to just tell them that you're going to prove that that's your card. Flip it over. Take the nine of clubs. But really you're taking their card. Place it on the table. Just do a magic wave like. <sighs> just tell them. You see. None of these cards are your cards. Because just like I told you. This card right here is your card. And they'll be absolutely shocked. It's a very powerful trick because their card just jumped from here to here. I mean, it's it's definitely one of my favorite tricks. So please, if you like the video, please leave a like, subscribe, um, and comment. Thanks. Bye.